just look around the city. Homelessness appears to be more present than ever before, especially during this pandemic. And right now, advocates are working overtime to help those who need help the most. Once a hub for entertainment and sports, the Richmond Coliseum now serves as a temporary home for those without. This is where many of our homeless take shelter. There's a slight awning. Tracy Bird Eagles with Blessing Warriors RVA helps find other places for the homeless to stay as the city prepares to tear down the massive rundown building. So the alternative is to find somewhere else safe. On the city's south side, Caritas's new shelter houses dozens of women who have no other place to go. It's a reminder of the important work we do. Thursday, Caritas CEO and President Karen Stanley conducted the twice annual national point in time count across Central Virginia, a HUD requirement to determine how many homeless individuals live in our neighborhoods. This morning was the largest group that I'd ever had. We had 12 people that we just in southern Chesterfield that we um, encountered. So that was big. It's usually maybe seven or eight. She snapped this photo of one of the camps, a sobering image of life for hundreds of people. So we had a married couple um, that we hadn't had before and people that admittedly said they had mental health issues. Back at the Coliseum, the city posted notices on the tents last month, notifying campers of the impending demolition and listing the crisis line for the homeless. The city's homeless services liaison tells me since April, they've worked to move the homeless, which topped at 23 tents, now down to seven, to save for places like hotels and connect those who want help with other services. And they can put this fence and circle this building all they want, but the circle and cycle of homelessness continues. Now, I want to put a number on your screen, a phone number. That is the Homeless Connection Line. If you or someone you know is three days of less or less of losing housing or already experiencing homelessness, call that number and they will connect you to the resources that you need.